There are thousands of DOS games. Most of them are terrible. I play one selected at random with a 20 minute time limit and record it live. This is the result. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to another random DOS game show. And the obsessed maniacs proudly present... Ty! Well, that's a great start. Invaders Warp. Ah, Not quite. I've already played TIE Fighter, so I don't know what I was expecting. Hit I for instructions. This looks like it's in text mode. And we've got a lovely little theme. Instructions for TIE Invaders. You're this little thing here, and have to shoot all the big bad TIE Fighters from space, which are those things. Do this by pressing the space bar, and the arrow keys to move left or right. Well, how hard could it be, huh? But attention! Uh-oh. The TIE Fighters won't be pleased about the things you do, and shoot back to do the same thing with you you did to them. Namely, kill you! So watch out for their deadly missiles, and avoid them as often as you can. Because if not, you're gonna lose one of your three lives! Yo, man! But calm down. Every 1,000 points, you'll gain an extra life. So now have fun with this little product of my boredom and good luck. Okay. So sometimes there'll be a little green TIE Fighter. Shoot it and it'll reveal a falling S. Now just don't move, collect the S and your shoot bar will be increased. Please tell me it's not going to scroll the screen as we're playing. Well, let's give it a go, I guess. Get ready! All right. Oh, it is going to scroll the screen. Oh, no. Do you see the problem here? I sincerely hope you see the problem. <laughs> it's almost impossible to tell. What is sh being shot at you? Oh, no. So, it's just a uh, fixed screen shooter, and enemies come from the top, and you have to kill them fairly swiftly, otherwise they will overwhelm you with bullets that you cannot possibly see. And some of them will dive bomb at you as well, in the style of certain other shooter games. And I'm already going to lose. I'm on my last life. And I barely started. Someone needed to desperately check the uh, difficulty levels of this game, because this is borderline impossible. Maybe it's just a me thing. I don't know. But I could not, for the life of me, see what was going on there. And there's the mandatory Hall of Fame. Let's try that one more time, shall we? Can we skip this? Yes, we can. Cool. It's well programmed for what it is. Don't get me wrong. Oh. Right, here we go again. Let's just have one of those spreading shots. There we go. That'll clear a few. Ah! I'm not even saying anything. I'm concentrating so much on dodging these. Ah, no. I just can't do it. My eyes just are not designed to be able to see. See, I got the weapon upgrade there. That helps a little. So I can at least demonstrate weapon upgrades existing, if nothing else. There's another weapon upgrade. Right. Oh, I see. The game slows down a little bit if there's too much on screen. Well, that helps. Now, if I can just edge myself over to take this guy out. Ah, oh, he's, he's avoiding my shots. Also, the weapon upgrade is persistent between lives. Well, that's nice. Good work, devs. Well, that makes it a little bit easier. So I can actually showcase a little bit of the game instead of just constantly dying all the time. Ah, no. Game over. But I got a much higher score that time. Congratulations.
Let's see Lonnie in all his glory above Lonnie. Yeah? Yeah, there we go. Number four. Not too bad. Only KB can beat me. The creators. But those are entirely arbitrary scores that were programmed in. So, what is Die Invaders? It's an extremely fast-paced, fixed shooter, and the only way to stand any chance of beating it is to flood the screen with so much fire that the game itself slows down. Or you can just dump down that cycles count if you want. It's actually really well done for what it is. It has a lovely theme, I like the text mode, I just wish there was a way to disable the scrolling stars. They really put me off. But other than that, it's well programmed, and it's easily the best TIE Fighter based game for DOS of all time. Well, no, okay, maybe not. For a Twitch bullet hell version of Space Invaders, sort of, then yeah, this is well done. So kudos to the people who made it for fun in their spare time. And if you like me talking about random DOS games, I do it all the time. Feel free to take a look at the hundreds of other videos on the channel. If you like what you see there, you can always subscribe. And if you can score over a thousand in Thai Invaders, you're probably one of my crackshot patrons. Look at those great names. Invaders? Not gonna happen on their watch. A wonderful group of flight officers. So yeah, another quality little title, but a very, very difficult one. Until next time.